What's up guys? Welcome to Roguelike Rundown, name subject to change. And today, I thought I'd go back to sort of a roots of roguelikes. Not to Rogue itself, but something quite similar. I'm talking, of course, about NetHack. Now, as I'm sure you're aware, NetHack is a game based on ASCII graphics, and it was made in uh, about 1987. Now, NetHack has a copyleft license, which basically means that people are free to distribute copies and modified versions of it, but this comes with a stipulation that the same rights have to be preserved in derivative works down the line. In other words, if you want to make a NetHack derivative game, then, well, go nuts. Anyway, I think it's about time we got down to business here. Let's make our character. First, we'll need to start with a name. Hmm. Hmm. I name you... The Schnaffelbergen Jones. Let's randomise this a bit. Okay, so we have ourselves a chaotic male human monk. And so the game treats us to some nice flavour text, which we are summarily going to completely ignore. So, here we are on B1 of the dungeon. Let's have a little look around with our cat and see what we can find. Ooh, a scroll. I'm sure this could be useful in the future, provided I figure out how it works. As I'm sure you're aware by now, I'm not actually recording this audio live. I apologise for this, I appear to have lost the audio while I was recording. No door, eh? I beg to differ. Okay, on closer inspection, that is not in fact a door. That, however, is. Nice doggies. Nice doggies. Ah, good, I killed them. Hmm, getting hungry. Might as well eat something. What? Well... That was a quick one. Um, yeah, that is not what I expected to happen. Oh well, farewell as a schnaffle 